was so surreal. I, I know I keep using that word, but I remember walking down, uh, I think it was Broadway or one of the streets in Manhattan that had a little monitor. Uh, it had a movie theater where they were playing Saturday Night Fever. It had a little monitor set up in front so people walking by could see coming attractions, um, previews of some sort. Uh, and I remember walking over and, and seeing the big Saturday Night Fever sign. And I thought, oh, you know, because you don't think anybody's looking at you when you walk down the street. And, and I stopped and I, I was watching some of the footage. And I was really digging it. And all of a sudden, this crowd started to assemble. And, and I so watching, thinking, oh, this is it, and they're doing that, and I thought, what, what? I had no clue. I had, and it terrified me, because I didn't know how to respond or, oh, you're this girl in here, and, and I said, well, yeah, I am, and, and and then suddenly there were more and more and more, and I, it was the first time I had thought about anonymity or 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 just being in the hub of something that popular. Uh, and I kind of said, well, I have to go now. And I grabbed a cab and I got out of there. And I was simultaneously thrilled and scared out of my wits, you know. Um, but then it, it started to really snowball. And I started to get offers for other work. And I liked that a lot. That was good. Um, and I had meetings set up in Los Angeles vis-a-vis -vis the agents and what have you and I suddenly found myself you know sitting at lunch with incredibly important people and famous people desperately trying not to spill something on myself still that early insecurity never oh, quite goes away I remember having um, lunch with Neil Simon and Herb Ross which hello uh, just even saying their names, you know, scares me. So, no, well, and I remember I had on a scarf, of, and I remember at the end of the um, the lunch, I uh, I was incredibly careful, and at the end of lunch, I wiped my face with my scarf, which I thought was, you know, so me. <laughs> and I think Neil had said something like, you know, you're wiping your face with your scarf. I said, yes, I do that all the time. <laughs> Quirky me.